Okay, so I'm going to be doing an energetic check-in on your person. And this reading is how your person feels about you. Some of these things you may know. Some of these things you may not be aware of. At this current moment, I do not have a spread pulled already. I'm going to shuffle and I'm going to pull my spread in the midst of recording at this moment. So what comes out, comes out. In this current moment, there is no signs. This is for whoever this resonates. It's not going to resonate with everybody. But this is how the collective's person sees them. How they really see them. These are the things that they might say or won't say. Because they can't say. Okay, so for starters, in the East position, this is how this person views you spiritually. And in the East position, we have the eagle in reverse. The eagle is spirit. So this person, how they see you spiritually, they may see you being involved. This is going to be read two ways. They may see you being involved with yourself. Or being like deep into your spirituality but then again they very well may not they may feel that you know your spirit doesn't your spirituality doesn't go with their religion or you know whatever they may believe in in a southern position a southern position represent how they see you in the material world so maybe your spirituality scares this person because you have the fear in reverse it may scare them, but then again, at the same time, they may see that you're scared of yourself in the material world. This is how they view you. They view you as being, like, not conquering your inner fears. They feel that you're hiding yourself. You're trying to be what everybody else wants you to be. And the West position, the West position tells how they will interact with your deepest desires so you have the dragonfly in reverse the dragonfly represents illusions um they're gonna pull an illusion overall i guess that's self-explanatory um they're gonna pretty much give you whatever they think it is you want so it doesn't necessarily mean that that's whatever however they're interacting with you is exactly what it is it may not be what it is so i'm gonna have to ask you to use your discernment and because everything seems like it's on an up and up or they seem like they're cool with everything that's going on in this current moment it does not mean that so how do they see you intellectually that's what the northern position is going to tell us the northern position has the otter the otter represents woman medicine so intellectually, they definitely see your feminine side. They see that nurturing, that caring, that that side of you that can come together with others, that side of you that tends to heal others. So your overall total summary of how they view you with the center card would be the swan in reverse. The swan represents grace. So with the swan in reverse, you have the um the water pretty much is on top. And the swan is technically up underneath water in this moment. You may be dealing with a lot of stuff emotionally and it's showing in other ways whether you realize it or not. And they think that you're being a little over emotional. They feel that it doesn't that they don't see your grace, but but however you're reacting to them or whatever's going on between the two of you in this current moment, they feel that you can deal with it better than what you are. They feel that you are allowing your emotions to get the best of you. So, overall, this is how your person in this current moment energetically feel about you. These are some of the things they will say and will not say. This is how they will move with move around with you or will not move around with you. So, do keep in in mind that 
in your western position of how they will react to your deepest desires they are going to move along with the illusion that you are pulling so i guess that's a perception thing whatever you want it to be they're gonna go with it but it doesn't mean that that's what it is <laughs> 